Hi everyone and welcome to this Star Rapid tutorial on designing for 3D metal printing. Today we're going to look at some basic information about 3D metal printing. Information that will be a good foundation for when you start designing your parts. Here at Star we mainly work with direct metal laser melting. You might know it as DMLM. So when taking you through these tutorials, we'll do that within the framework of our own machinery. So here are a few basic guidelines to take into consideration about your design. Did you design it for an additive manufacturing process? We often encounter inquiries from companies that send us a design made for subtractive manufacturing. If you've designed your product for subtractive manufacturing, you won't see any benefits when using additive manufacturing. Are there differences in capabilities between different 3D metal printers? The short answer is yes. There are differences in limitations for different machines, so remember to check with your manufacturer to get the specific limitations for their printer. Does that mean I have to learn how to design for each 3D printer? Thankfully, you don't. Although there are differences in limitations, you'll be able to apply the same techniques to most machines. Thanks for joining us for this introduction on how to design for 3D metal printing. In our next video, we'll be looking at limitations, starting with wall thickness, gaps and holes. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Until next time.